How's it going everybody? My name is Joe and I'm going to be reacting to Young Justice Season 4 Episode 5. And before we continue, please subscribe to the channel and like the video. Our city. We're different, finally. Hey, girls need a healthy breakfast. Who said it? Victor Hugo, Professor Crow! Oh, well, the bishop Hugo. Hugo said it to Jean Valjean! professor now? <laughs> <laughs> A it's Connor. Damn. No way they actually killed him, right? Right? Fight. It's too damn Damn. big for her, Crusher. How's she supposed to succeed wearing your hand-me-downs? She had everything here and threw it all away. Maybe. All I know is I need to try. Do you know where Jade is? At Harbor. Big mistake. Watch it! Because Artemis Tigris. Cheshire. <laughs> My name is Onyx. Onyx Adams. And I need your Never help. Heard of you. <laughs> so you want us to believe that Vandal Savage's daughter would believe that we would believe that she'd ever in 50,000 years betray her father? Oh, as a matter of fact. Like the conundrum. Why have you come, girl? I taught you many things, Jade Wen. Foolishness is not one of them. This isn't the <laughs> act of a fool. Something quite different. Oh, yeah, I'm assuming. So this is true. You've defected? I thought he'd kill me, but Vandal Savage doesn't believe in wasting a potential asset. So instead, he did this to teach me a lesson. Oof. I mean, how can we be sure? Huh? We may need some help working this out. I will never give Damien up. Then you're a selfish fool. And you are a coward. Dal come after you. Let him. I'll disappear like the Cheshire Cat. <laughs> Someone has to be here when Mom gets out. Haven't you learned anything? In this family, it's every girl for herself. Uh oh. Look out! Oh. oh. I'm hit. Oh. Hey. Oh. Got the sword hand to hand here. Yeah, blood lord. <laughs> oh. ah, keep the pen. Compliments of bow hunter security. On second thought, I'm gonna need that back. Oh. oh. Okay. Oh. Thank you. All right. Well, they both helped. Temporary cells A and B secured. Tara, you knew them both when you were a shadow. What do you think? Hard to believe she'd ever betray him, the light, or the shadows. Orphan, you were a shadow too. Should we trust Cassandra? There's even a chance one of them or both is telling the truth. We have to protect her. Or them. Everyone deserves a chance at redemption. Why did you call me? I didn't. I did. Damn, yeah, like that. Far better rest that I go to than I have ever known. Charles Dickens, A Tale of Two Cities. Alrighty, that was episode five of Young Justice. And man, that was definitely pretty sad. The fact that they are really playing it off that Superboy did die is very concerning. I'm really hoping he really didn't die. It was definitely a pretty glorious death based off the actions of what happened. But if he really did die, 
I'd be quite sad. But if he didn't, I still feel like there's some twist going on. It had to be those three people from the future that's been watching over them. So that's what I'm crossing my fingers, hoping for. But I guess we'll see in these future episodes and how they kind of bring that around. But this episode literally brought us back to Earth and followed Artemis and just her realization and finding out about this and just the heartache that she feels for losing a friend and knowing McGann is going through what she went through and losing Wally. So just seeing her physically cry and sob and just as her days went on, she got more and more depressed. But this episode definitely turned a little bit when we see Artemis wanting to talk to her sister. And we got a lot of flashbacks with both her and her sister with Sportsmaster and just how hard he was on them. And through that, seeing both of their journeys as she continued on with her training and Jade going off and living on her own. But luckily for them, they kind of reunite at the end after the fact that Jade tried to go kill Ra's al Ghul, which, yeah, good luck with that. And he gave a pretty good proposal. If you want to live, come on back because I know you came here to die. So... We'll see. We'll see what that means. Also, Roz saying they're not part of the shadows of the light. They're part of the gray now. What does that mean? Are they on their own? They're kind of playing both sides. I don't know. I guess we'll see. Especially after the fact that that incorporated with the stuff going on with Artemis and crew, all the basically the Arrow people team at uh, at Star City, where we see two ex shadow members coming to talk to artemis to try to convince her to save them because one was trying to warn of the other the other was leaving because she just didn't feel safe and she was the most loyal of loyal within the shadows and i don't know there was a lot of back and forth this crazy conundrum they don't know who's right who's wrong who's telling the truth who's not so that is definitely going to be expanded upon for this next arc, I'm assuming. I'm kind of, I'm trying to remember like how the episodes were structured in previous seasons. It's been a long, long time since I've seen any of the past seasons of Young Justice. And whether each episode was kind of its own thing or they kind of uh did it in pods, like how they're doing it here with these arcs, it seems like. Or was it just uh in sync, just one episode after the other, they're all connected, which will which I am open to the idea of either. I'm used to the arc format because of the Star Wars, Clone Wars, Rebels series and such. So we'll see. Hoping we get more of the team. We finally saw Calder and Nightwing here. And it's been a while since we've seen them. But I don't know. It's basically the two things that it looks like it's going to be focused on. Here is the whole who is right, who is wrong between these two captives and what Artemis wants to and what Artemis wants to heal with her sister and how that's going to play out and just in the back end with Roz and the shadows so we'll see I'm very excited to see what comes next other than that that is all I have if you have any questions or theories please leave in the comment section below my boy Joey is the editor for this video and if you're in need of an editor please check out the description below and his email will be there if you enjoyed the reaction please like the video subscribe and I'll see you on the next one